sitting right there. There is the new cage. It is basically a CNC cage. It has the bottom floor there and then they can go up top. So yes, I didn't want to give you a haul that I just went to PetSmart and got like tons of stuff. So yeah, if I get it that real quick, sorry about this. I'm going to make this an unedited video. I'm just too lazy to just But I can't remember how much everything was, but anyways, let's start off with these treats. Um, all this stuff is fine at the end. I know, it is, it's fine. But I got these little candy-covered sunflower seed treats, and they love sunflower seeds, and they love, um, yogurt. So, I think they'd love these. I like little bean things. And then next, I got this woven apple toss toy. So it's made of just, like, straw. I can chew one and just toss her in. It's hollow on the inside. And they're being crazy over there, as they always are. So yeah, there it is. The next thing, I'm not sure if they're chewing this or not, but uh, it's a bear roller. It's a wood chew. Um, and it has this little ball on the inside, so they can move it around. It's really cute. And the next thing I got is this knot nibbler. Um, and these two things were recommended by a lot of people for wood shoes that guinea pigs would like. So, um, this is the Knot Nibbler. This all is for guinea pigs, meant for guinea pigs. And the devil just went upstairs if you see her there. She likes eating up there. And I'm putting some of this stuff up there. But yeah, this is their Knot. It has a little ball inside it. It's really cute. And the next treats we got them are these little alfalfa peels. Carrots. And they're made with alfalfa and, um, corn. And it's their little carrot. It's really cute. Um, then is these carrot salt licks. They don't have to have salt licks, but, um, it can be part of their diet. And it tastes like carrots. And they like it. It has a holder already with it. So it'll work really well. She's coming back down there. There she goes. Yeah, she understands how to get up there and everything. Ginger hasn't really figured it out yet. But, um, the last few things I got is I got this new hay rack. Um, this one goes like this. And I'm going to put it on their top shelf up there so they can have another hay feeder. Because I have one on the bottom, but I just want another up top so they want to go up there. So, next I got a new water bottle for them because their other one is leaking. It is a flat back super pet water bottle. So it's flat, so it fits in their cage really well. And it has this little duck on it, so you can tell where the water's at. And then it has an easy twist knob on the back. And my kitty's here to say hello. Meow. Meow. Yeah. <laughs> and the last thing I got, which is, I'm so excited about this, and I think I love it, is this um, Eco Tristan Snack Stack. It's, um, so basically it's this log that they can go inside. It's hollow on the inside so they can go through it. And, um, it's made out of alfalfa and honey so they can eat it. So it's 100% edible. Um, she scares them. Yeah. But, so, um, I believe this was $11. So yeah, it's by Ecotrition, which I love that brand. It's for guinea pigs and rabbits. So yes, it is safe for guinea pigs. See, it looks like a log. It has a hole in the top, too. Yes, that was my guinea pig haul, and look forward to a guinea pig cage tour soon. Hope you enjoy this video. Bye.